While we're preparing for a storm here, crews in Florida continue cleanup efforts after Hurricane Michael slammed the region about two weeks ago. And take a look at the damage the hurricane caused in Panama City's historic district. It's devastating, but businesses there are rebuilding. Iowa News News reporter Caroline Goggin is in Florida assisting our sister station there. She joins us now with more details. We're joining you from St. Andrews tonight, which is a historic district here in Panama City, and we want to give you a tour of what exactly the destruction from Hurricane Michael looks like here. Along Beck Avenue, cleanup continues. A FEMA contractor out here tonight working. Now, this is the main street, essentially, here in St. Andrews. The storefronts line this street, many of them right now littered with debris outside. Most of them are closed. Just a couple of stores back open two weeks after the storm. Just a block down the road here at St. Andrews Marina, you can tell that Hurricane Michael wreaked havoc. This marina was founded in 1960 and the boats were meant to line up next to each other. But right now, this is just utter chaos. Pieces of boats are now stuck in the water as some vessels are fully submerged. And any stores in this area that are still closed following the storm bear the same message on their doors to the community. They will be back. Reporting in Panama City, I'm Carolyn Goggin, Eyewitness News.